<laughs> I forgot the term. Yeah. Unconditioned <laughs> stimulus. Uh, no, so today, folks, today, today, this moment, this one minute that you have, we're going to talk about unconditional stimuli, unconditioned stimuli, unconditional stimuli. Depends on which translation you'd like from Pavlov. I prefer the unconditional one. So an unconditional stimulus is something you don't need to learn anything about. Um, it's just something you react to that your body creates an automatic sort of reflex. So if someone, see, there was a bit of a startle response. You had to watch my eyes. But what he really threw at me, actually, he might throw another one. You never know. Um, the, ha, the, it, unconditional stimuli coming out of the sky. I love it. Um, so no, the chocolate's an unconditional sim. Ooh, operate responding too. Um, so uh, unconditional stimuli had to, the food is an unconditional stimulus. You don't have to learn that food is, in itself is good for you. Now chocolate on the other hand, now that's really good for you, special unconditional stimuli. But just in general, the U.S., right? So the U.S. Um, in classical conditioning is what we're referring to. The U.S. gets paired with an N.S. and that produces a C.S. And there's more coming randomly. Shit, that one came over the light. I don't know what's going to happen. Um, the, the, there's startle responses and I'm getting nervous. And it's just, I don't know, this shit's just going to go. And I don't know what to do. Unconditional stimuli stimuli, things you don't need to learn to respond to that produce a reflex automatically. Thank you very much. Ah! <laughs>